How's it going, Zero Warriors? Welcome back to another video of Final Fantasy 16, continuing this wonderful, awesome, amazing game. I like it so much. I would highly recommend. I've already said that in a lot of my parts, but no, literally, it's worth the money. <laughs> um, we're gonna help this cutie out. Hey, cutie, what do you need? Do you have a moment, Sid? Why you have blood on your face? The team of cursed what is, has gone missing. What is that on your which, face? Is that blood? Which team? Doesn't look Holes. good. They were sent to liberate a carriage of bearers before they could be smuggled to market. They were moving in for their assault when the carriage was attacked by well, that sound good. A curse breaker managed to release a stolas amid the confusion, but <sighs> this was days ago. They should be back by now, but I've heard yeah, nothing from any of them. You would think so. I can't help but worry that they know the work is dangerous. But I'm sure they're fine. But I don't know. I killed. I would go and look, you know? Before they go out, I always remind them why we're doing this, what they escaped, and what we're freeing people from. But I never really thought how my words might affect them, what risks they might take because of the things I've said. Well, that's their own stupidity if they do it. <laughs> I'll go and find them. We'll both rest easy. They have their own safe. mind. Thank you, Sid. And. I'm sorry to trouble you with this. The plan was to intercept the slaver somewhere in the Dragon's Airy. I can't tell you much more than that, I'm afraid. That should be enough to go on. If they were there, Torgo will track them down. Well, I don't know why you can't tell me much more than that when I am the guy that's running this whole operation in this place. Oh, it used to have been Sid, but I'm now the one that's taking over. And you can tell me, okay, whatever. Whatever, it is what it is. We gotta find some people that need our help that are probably in danger or maybe they're already dead. Hopefully they're not dead because that would not be a good sign. Traveling all the way to north, whatever the F that says. <laughs> Alright, who are we looking for? It's like 200 and some odd yards away. That's Slavers freaking... don't even bother with Northridge now that all the highborn have fled south. Who's, who's talking? Who's talking? Oh, uh, what what are you doing? I won't have you spoiling another catch. Yo, yo, be nice to the guy, owl. Or I'm slicing your balls off next time, okay? Oh, you're not even listening. He doesn't even care if he gets his balls sliced. Okay, fine then. Whatever happens, it's on you, man, not me. Come here, my awesome chocobo! Yeah. We're riding that chocobo! We're getting that chocobo, and we're smacking the crap out of these things! Yeah, it's not me, it's the chocobo that's doing it, my chocobo is. Ah! They hate this! They hate it! Ah. <laughs> there we go, it's dead. There we go! Onward! Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, giant chicken! Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, giant chicken! Okay, now what? Um, is there anyone around here? I mean... Hello? I hope there's no one dead around here. Is that the guy? I think that's the guy. Oh no, there's a lot. Are you alright? You haven't been here around for days. Is everything good? Cole, I'm glad you were in one piece. Yeah, I Just thought you were dead. Sid, if you don't mind me asking, what are you doing here? Doris sent me to find you. She hasn't heard anything since the attack. She's been worried about you. I sent a runner to the dame in Northridge. The hideaway should have learned of our survival yesterday. Well, I'm here now. And it looks like you freed the bearers. Yay! Only some. The rest locked themselves in the slaver's carriage rather than fleeing when they had the chance. Damn it! I want to help them, Sid. But we're barely in any state to protect those few we did save. You made the right decision. Now where's the carriage? The goblins may still be out there. You have okay. duties to attend to here. See to the injured. I'll handle the rest. I'll take care of those pesky right. goblins. Just follow the path to the south. You'll come across the carriage soon enough. And please, hurry. If the beastmen get to those bearers, the poor souls will be eaten alive. Well, that's not I good. I won't let that happen. Thank you. And Sid. It's good to see you. Good to see you too. I yet. don't even remember seeing you, but good to see you too. I can't even remember if I saw you or not, but yeah, it's good to see you either way. 
Um, no, we don't need my chocobo for this. We can just walk there. Cause look, it's just like down here. It's not that far. We, I'm not that lazy. Sheesh. Um. They're trying to get into the carriage. Stay out of the carriage, you stinking goblins! They're always making a freaking ruckus about everything, harming people and just ah, oh, disturbing the peace. And I have to come and destroy you, even if you have this big mother effort. I fought bigger guys than this, that's for sure. Definitely in my own mind. Psychologically wise, I'll fight myself. That, you know, confess that the truth, it was me. That didn't really kill my brother, because my the brother is still alive. Slicey dicey, giggle bastard! I'm calling him. <laughs> I know that's not his name, but I'm calling him that. You're dead, pus. You're dead, pus. You're dead, pus. You're dead, 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 <laughs> oh, you leave these poor ferrets alone! Coming out of nowhere and attacking them like that! And Now I'm destroying your eating the anus, fisting you now, right in the butt! With my rocket fist! That's a rocket fist! <laughs> ah, crap on my hand! Oh my god, I shouldn't have did that! Goblin. You're going down, you old bastard! Come on, stop bastard! You're going down, motherfucker! Time to destroy you! Oh, oh, oh! We dodged it and we sliced at the same time! Boom! Yeah, we just like powered up and we destroyed them! Now those goblins better know not to attack one of my people. Who are you? I here to save you. I'm Clive slash Slid. Are there any more survivors? Why they look like they're the injured. Others? If the goblins had made it through that door, you wouldn't have stood a chance. Why should we run? One miserable death's no worse than another. Perhaps. But we're here to give you another choice. Freedom, safety, the life you've been denied. Come with us. Let us protect you. Exactly. See, I, I couldn't just let you. Too late. I already, already did it. Too late then. Thank exactly. God. This man risked his... How much you want to bet he seen me slay them, then he just decided to come along and just say, Oh, I can't let you. Oh, oh, it's too late. Oh, oh my God. I bet you he knew it was over. He already knew. He, like, it wasn't too far from where you were sitting at. You probably were watching and having popcorn with them I back to then. Yours, to give you a second chance. Fine. Do with us what you will. What we'll do with you is take you to safety. After that, it's up to you. Your lives are your own now. Exactly. Leave the rest to us, Sid. We'll get everyone back to the hideaway. Thank you. I'll let Doris know we're expecting new arrivals. That guy actually could have came with me, but no. And then he was like, "Oh, I was gonna come here to hell." He was just making lies up right there, y'all. We know, see you could. He could see us from there. Think, come on! Literally! He knew that I was done before he got there, like... Thinks I'm gonna fall for his shenanigans? No. Uh, I'm guessing we are going back to the hideaway, right? Yes, we are. He already knew the battle was over, y'all. He, he came at the very, like, when I actually killed the guy and he was... Wants to act like he like wasn't neglecting them, though he was. So there is that. Sid, welcome back. Thanks. 
I stole this from the Dane, arrived not long after you left. If I'd just waited a little longer, I might have been able to deal with things myself. Or maybe I wouldn't. I keep making the wrong decisions. Cole and the others got home safely. You made exactly the right decision. No, I was lucky. Where are you, though? I was tracking that slaver for months, and then I sent Cole and you after them woefully unprepared. What kind of leader sends people into danger without considering all the risks? I should have urged greater caution, told Cole to be wary, to pull back at the first sign of trouble. We swore the same oath as you, Doris. It's good to see you safe and well. Yeah, the guy didn't came in at the last minute say, oh, I'm a little, oh, it seems like I'm a little too late. He knew he was late. He could see me from that distance fighting them and at the last slash of that giggle bastard going down, then he decided to come over and to, 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 to act like he's innocent, like he wasn't just sitting there and let me do all the work. I'm sorry. You call yourself a warrant. Pooey! Curse breakers don't risk our lives because you commanded of us. We risk them because we believe in our cause. No one with doubts ever joins our ranks. The agony of removing the brand more than sees to that. We all know how much bravery that takes. You don't get no respect from oh. me, dude. <laughs> I never doubted your courage. Only my ability to see it put to good use. What courage? You didn't even help! You didn't even help me! Thank you. Let me do Thank all the work! Then he came sure when it that. was dead. I sometimes wonder if I might prefer to risk death alongside the others than ask it of them. But I'm a curse breaker. I swore an oath too. I have a role to play. And I must trust that I'm the right one to play it. You will. In time. In time indeed, in time. The weight of command. Interesting, interesting indeed. Well, that guy just ticked me off because he didn't, he just came in at the very last moment. And then he says, like, oh, I'm here to help, though. So, in a way, Welcome and to he's like, oh, it's too late. He knew it was too late. You'll he came when it showed step. that giggle thing falling down to its death. He knows it was dead. There, he just made that up to make it seem like he's in it, like he was going to hell, but he wasn't. I don't. I, that's what I see. He wasn't. He wasn't going to help at all. Um. Okay, and there's, by the looks of it, no other side missions to deal with in here or there. So, I want to say let's get to the spot that will start the side mission. But first, I want to go to uh, this guy right here. Looks like he must have something new. What do you need? What do I need? What do I? I need a lot of things, but, oh, you are what? He has a new sword! Oh, yes! I'll take that. So myself. I'll take that sword. Wait. Now I don't have any more of that? Wait. Is it because I got the sword instead? Probably. And how am I meant to do that then? Or, wait, never mind. I don't know, dude. I thought maybe you could just pull one out of your ass. Anything else? No, doesn't look like it. Right. Fine. Ooh, ooh, look at this blade! Oh, I like these blades, yeah. It's all right. Oh, wait, we might. Do we need any potions? I don't even know if well, I don't used them yet. Stand there gulping. Maybe I want to stand there gulping. Maybe I want to. weighing you down. No, I just want to see if you have any potions. I mean, I don't need any. Never mind. Do I need a drink? No. Nah. Anyways, y'all, we're going to end this part here. So if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more content. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video comes out. Like, share, do all that wonderful stuff. 
And in the next part, we're going to continue the main mission. And like always, viewers, I appreciate you all and stay awesome. Bye, 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 peace.